Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to another video tutorial. Alright, um, to convert an outline to an object in CorelDRAW, it's very simple. So there are two different ways to do it. Alright, so this is an outline of a circle. So you select the circle, you go to the menu bar. Under the menu bar, you select object. Under object, you go to this area where you have convert outline to object. So the second way, which is the shortcut key, is um, Control Shift Q. So you select it or use the shortcut key. So we have access to edit this outline to our choice so let's undo it so this was how it was before so you can't do much thing there so um by converting it to an the outline to an object Control shift q so you have access to many edits so you can apply a gradient apply a power clip here so um so many different things too so same thing applies to text same thing applies to other shapes the house and outline too so let's give this um this square is um, a few color let's say red move the outline you right click here so um let's create a circle hold control then you drag so delete this so let's increase the outline of this circle let's say eight all right i want to use the circle to cut through this square here so um you highlight it then you go to the menu the property bar then you select trim so this is not what i want it's cutting a part but i want the circle to cut through so this is what i want this is what i should do so you undo it then you convert this circle outline to an object so we go to object in the menu bar then you select convert outline to object or use the shortcut key Control shift q so you highlight then you come to the property bar and select trim so um you so this is how it works now so you can break this control key then apply a different color same thing applies to text that has an outline or object which has an outline all right guys that is it on this video all right if you find this video helpful do not use on the subscribe button turn on post notification bell to get notified when i upload new videos and don't forget to like share and comment on our videos thank you for watching and see you on the next video tutorial